Good morning everyone and happy Easter. It is about to be 9 o'clock and I am fully ready to go. Hair, makeup, outfit. Um, only thing I have to do is put my lipstick on. But let me show you what I'm wearing today. So this is my outfit. Super cute. This outfit is from Rude Rebels, so I will go ahead and link their IG down below. Definitely go ahead and check her out. She's got a bunch of cute clothes. Um, sorry for the lighting. It's super bad. I am in my son's nursery right now. Um, but I am actually about to go and wake him up because it is almost time to go. Uh, we have to go all the way to Riverside. We are going to be celebrating Easter with my family out there. Um, my husband is already up and getting ready. And yeah, I'm going to go get my son ready now. And yeah, I guess we will see you when we get there. I will show you his outfit once I get him dressed and ready to go. He's looking, he's going to look so freaking cute. I cannot wait. But anyways... See you guys in a bit. Papacito. Oh, I feel bad waking you up, but it's time to go. Good morning, Papas. Hi. Good morning, handsome. <laughs> you sound a little congested. Oh no. I hope you're not getting sick. Hi. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> oh my god, you're just the cutest thing ever. Hi, Papa. Good morning. Show everybody your handsome face. Ah, take that out of your mouth. Show everybody your handsome face. Can you smile? <laughs> Good morning. Good morning. Yeah? Alright, let's get you up. Diaper change, fed. And then your outfit on, okay, Papa? All right, guys, we'll see you guys in a bit. Hi, Papa, you ready? You ready? It's in his backpack in the diaper bag. Hi, Papa, are you ready? Yeah. Yeah, Papa. You are not having so many time right now. No, you're not. So this is his outfit. I know you can't really see it right now, but it's going to go with these shoes. And then I have a little hat and sunglasses for him. So we're just packing up the car right now. And then we're going to be heading out if we do have a bit of a drive. So we'll see you guys. this on Christmas you know it's gonna be short and sweet but we have to put God in here somewhere don't we, yes, yes, we do. okay uh, this one I thought was very appropriate for everybody involved the young the old uh, and uh, so anyways it says you are my hope O Lord God you are my most trust from my youth by you I have been upheld from birth you are he who took me out of my mother's womb. And then it goes on to say, God has blessed us with the powerful gift of memory. Looking at old photos brings back pleasant feelings of nostalgia and evokes powerful emotions. A mother sees a picture of her child and feels a nurturing bond. 
A child sees himself and renews his sense of belonging to his family. And boy, we have a family. <laughs> Throughout the Old Testament, the call to remember and believe comes from God. By reviewing his mighty acts, the children of Israel were encouraged to keep trusting in God while in their wilderness journey. God reminded them to pull out of their spiritual scrapbook and recall the dramatic times of his care and protection. Do you have a spiritual scrapbook? Begin one today by reflecting on your walk with Christ. Record the times he's answered prayers or brings healing or blessings. Journal your prayers and keep a record of God's answers. God gives us the gift of memory for more than sentiment or nostalgia. Use your memory today to remain strong in Him, knowing that He has been loving, watching over you from your very first breath until now. Amen. 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 Thank you. Uh, you. All right, as you know, there's usually more than one step to my game, so you got to be listening because we're going to have two teams, okay? So we're going to do an old-fashioned Easter egg hunt. Woo! Woo Extreme style, dodgeball style. Woo! Nice with my language. <laughs> but I'm going to ask that those... Gentle. Yes. Know no, who you can target and who you Gentle. you have your six. Any questions? You can get six except my three helpers get eight. Okay.
going to be jelly beans or a little piece of paper with a number or a little piece of paper with words. If it has words on it, zip it. Don't say what your word is. Just trust me. Zip it if it has a word. If it has a number, you want to save it. So go ahead and open your eggs. Collect your numbers. If you have numbers, if there's nothing in there, you got it done. So I got a done? No, just take out the little paper. Yeah, yeah, pretty much. Yes. Did he collect it? Yes. Okay. Open your eggs and there's a big ticket in it. If there's no ticket, can we eat our jelly beans? So just collect your tickets. You can eat your jelly beans. A ticket is your ticket. If it has a number, save the number. If it has a word, don't say the word. Okay. okay. Good. And if you got nothing, you it sucks to suck. <laughs> Thank you, shit. Oh, oh jelly beans. Nice <laughs> oh, jelly beans. I'm going to call out a number. I have the prizes right here, and they range since our family ranges from five months old to Pampa's 88, 9, 8, 15. Okay, 88. <laughs> so it's got a variety. There's some. There's a bottle of tapatillo. Oh, There's gift cards to Petco. There's a gift card to Walmart. There's a gift card to In-N-Out. There's junk food. There's toys. There's Tupperware for those movies. Movies. There's Q-tips. Victor really needs the Q-tips. He said so. Okay, so here we go. When I when I call the number, come and get your prize.
sorry, not sorry. <laughs> <laughs>